finally, after two whole months, I'm going to be revealing what I think are the top five weapons inside of the game. There's been a lot of buffs and nerfs since I last did one of these, so the results may shock you. Something else that may shock you, however, is this massive announcement I have. I am so excited for this, and I'm sure you guys are too. As far back as I can remember, I've always wanted to be at the top of gaming. My approach isn't casual or relaxed. Hey, it's me. This is my craft, something I've invested thousands of hours into. I started on console, but it wasn't until the rise of mobile gaming that I realized my true potential. Rules of Survival, Fortnite, Cyber Hunter. With every game, my dream came closer to fruition. Oh Nothing can hold me back. Police. Not even the bands. What? No way. I just got banned for being too One good. by one, I pursued getting my name on the top of every leaderboard. Oh one of these games, I became the face of Pod Mobile. And with Tribe Gaming behind me, I knew that I could set my sights even higher. I've had a lot of success in my career, but the work isn't done yet. I won't stop until I'm the face of the entire industry. Yep, I finally co-owned something. Along with this announcement, there's a brand new group channel called Tribe Frags. Here's the trailer. In this Tribe Frag series, I'm going to be taking the best FPS creators and putting them through daunting physical and mental challenges <laughs> to find out if they have what it takes to be a frag. Come on. You want the deadly? <laughs> no. Grenade! Oh, we're done, we're done. I'm going to die. You can check out that channel at the top of the description. The first video is already posted. It shows me out in the wilderness among non-gamers. You don't want to miss it. But now, for the top five. Honorable mention, of course, going to the DLQ. Gone are the days of satisfying snipes and insane clips. We'll love you forever, OG sniper rifle. An OG who's making a return, however, in the number five spot is the AK-117. There's even some people trying to say that this is the best weapon in the game currently. For me personally, I think it's great, but it's strange. When I pick it up off someone, it feels godly, untouchable. And then when I go and use my own loadout or copy other YouTubers' loadout, it's not as good. I don't understand. But what I do understand is the fact that the SKS slash SVD is in the number four spot. SKS being my favorite out of the two for the duo. But the SVD performs significantly better in search and destroy. If I am full tryharding, going for nooks, tearing through a win streak while being super accurate, this thing is the gun of choice. And if I want to be annoying, your boy up there, he's the go-to. The last honorable mention on this list goes to the GKS. Now, I like this SM a lot. But there's two other on this list that are just simply better. It recently received a buff, making it stellar for dominance close range. But since it gets outclassed by our number three spot, the MAC-10, it stays in that honorable mention spot. The Glizzy Gobbler, however, is the most fierce, fully automatic, pure in COD mobile. There's nothing I hate more in this game than jumping into the hard point and having two people spray me down with the MAC-10. It feels like you get shot once and then you're dead. That's how fast the fire rate is. If you haven't used this, test out with this loadout. Trust me. Number two has to go to the Kilo. The M13's good too, but really the Kilo is the gun that you're gonna wanna use. And I get a lot of hate from people in my stream chat talking about how I don't use the mythic that I have for this gun. Look, dude, I love the iron sights of the regular weapon, all right? When it comes back in the shop, I'll give away a mythic in my Discord, I promise. I personally just don't like it as much. If I could love a gun like I loved Manta Ray back in 2020, it would be the Kilo. And I know what you're looking for. There it is. This means that the CBR takes the number one spot for obvious reasons. It's the overall best SMG, nearly as versatile as the Kilo. And with a loadout like this, you can't go wrong. Subscribe.